one of the three GW3 news and it's in contact with GW2A region. Uh, good morning, Bryce. Uh, Thanks, Mike. Uh, uh, yeah, okay, Jack. Yeah, I'm going to miss you. Well, in actual fact, when I was looking at it, I was sitting in the hospital in the emergency department, Kenny. Yeah, 
Arganook TRX 3015, 150 watt, 1.5 to 30 meg transceiver, 10 kcs to 30 meg receiver. This is GADPR reporting upon the operation of this superb 24 volt run transceiver also has a RACL adaptive radio control unit for remote control of the system, our data lines, etc, etc. The blank panel at the bottom is where the power supply, the 24 volt high, volt, uh, high current power supply sits, but I've had to take it out of the rack here and put it over here because of the racket that the fan makes on it. And you can't see that too well because of the colour light. And that is the 24 volt power supply and the fan makes a lot of noise. So at the moment I've pulled that out of the back of the rack and put it away from the receiver. But the receiver itself is absolutely superb. And you're trying to go onto a different one. Going to the channel table, three program channels. We can get back down to channel 800. It's a thousand channel programmable transceiver. So now, if I go to test on, here on 26690 GB3GX on Clee Hill, there is 80 meters. The AM net, Saturday morning AM net. Top band, five six eight eight. Experience and sandwich. And 
Try to select 14.2. There is 14.2, so 900. And we can now turn 14 minutes. You can go up to 2.7 kcs bandwidth. JDPR reporting upon the Hagenuke German TXRX 150 watt transceiver for the Pine Radio Telephone Museum of Great Britain. GADPR going QRC. 